So a little technical difficulty, we're talking about the experience for beginners. Yeah, again, the experience for beginners is something we pay very close attention to here, uh, specifically because um, we understand that you know it can be a challenging experience if you're not if you're not in shape or or if you've never been used to uh, uh, you know participating in a martial art. So again, a lot of attention, a lot of focus is is, is, is given to beginners to make sure that they just have the best possible experience because it's those beginners that um, invariably, uh, uh, or at least I think invariably, end up sticking around and, 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 and having this as part of their life, which ultimately, like I said earlier, is is is, is, is a very positive thing in a whole host of Areas. You mentioned um, some kind of health benefits and other benefits that you've experienced. Can you elaborate? Yeah, so personally, uh, I came into this uh, gym 40 pounds heavier. Um, um, so uh, it allowed me to lose a lot of weight. Um, it taught me about nutrition. It taught me about the importance of rest, the importance of sleep, uh, especially when you're active as, as you become uh, in this sport, uh, in this martial art, you, you, you need to learn those things as well. Um, you know, along with the health benefits, clearly comes psychological benefits. Uh, you know, whether it's whether it's being able to handle stress more, whether it's being able to be, uh, uh, you know, more compassionate, more loving. Um, you know, these are things that you often hear, but but, but you you hear them so much because they are true. This is what uh, this is what Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and martial arts in general do for the individual. And how would you say Open Mat benefits the community within which it resides? Well, other than creating a, a community, or if I want to be, you know, academic about it, a community of practice, you know, it, it puts people with 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 different backgrounds, different mindsets together to do something that um, um, that, that they do communally, and again, that ultimately breeds um, a lot of camaraderie and a lot of great friendships. I mean, these are people that friends that we're gonna, I'm going to have for life. Um, on top of that, um, we're, we're highly involved in, 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 in being part of the community and giving back in whatever way we can, whether it's in barbecues, our yearly summer barbecue uh, for the membership and our friends, whether it's holding events um, um, holding events so that people can come and see uh, see us in action to sort of showcase what we do, to, 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 to reaching out to First Nations communities here in Ontario, to, to um, you know, to, to, to at risk youth, uh, to, to, to women's self-defense classes. I mean, the focus is not just to, to come and have a great time. The focus is also to understand that, um, um, you know, with this with this level of, of amazingness, you have to give back. Cool. Anything, any last words? Anything else you want to add? Um, yeah, I can't stress enough how anybody who, who wants to try this should come and try this, uh, whether it's a private lesson at first or just coming straight into a class. Um, your experience will ultimately be a positive one. Um, yeah. Cool. Thank you very much. Thank you.